Today, I'm going to Walmart to search for the new mystery power cube. I'm here at Walmart to find the new mystery power cubes that came out. According to this tweet, which somebody sent me on Twitter, so thank you for that, letting me know that the new mystery cubes are out. So this is the Walmart that's had a ton of stuff, so I'm hoping that there's still a lot of stuff for us to get, and hopefully the newer stuff is the cubes. What are those? Uh-oh. They have them. The power cube. Every cube contains one booster pack, one mystery item, three duels packs, three bonus foreign packs, five rare cards, 20 commons. All right, we got them. Let's see what else they have over here. Okay, we obviously have to get some of these because we got a, by the way, yeah, killer. Got Cyberstorm. Little Dragon Ball Super. Ooh, they have the old power cubes. Maybe I should buy these too. Is it time to revisit the Lugia chase? I think it is. All right, just finished buying all the cubes and uh, we ran into a fan of the channel. That's First cool. time ever during a Walmart vlog. So, you wanna introduce yourself or anything? Yeah, my name is Byron. I just kind of met up with him. I might have met up with him. I just happened to see him. He was checking out some stuff. And I was like, hey, how's it going? I watch your channel all the time. Yeah, he said, why is he buying the cubes? And I was like, yeah, I mean, I'm the only one that buys these things. So. I figured I'd clear them out so nobody buys them because they suck. So that was pretty cool. There was a fan at Walmart. That's the first time that's ever happened. But uh, there's a lot of, we got a lot of stuff. So we got the mystery power cube. This is the old one. I figured we'd buy this and compare it to the newer one at some point. Uh, that one's terrible, by the way. Then we got two of these, the new one, to see if these are any better. 10K Dragon, is that going to be in there? No. I got two of these older ones as well, these mystery power boxes. You can never ha have too many mystery power boxes. You can also get these really cool tin or uh, pins in there, not tens, pins. And of course we got seven of the most expensive blisters of all time, the Battles of Legend Monsters Revenge. There is gonna be a Gaia slash Dark Magician. I, I'm just gonna call him Gaia because now he just looks like a Gaia, okay? And finally, we're gonna continue that silver Tempest Lugia Chase. So let's see if we can get it out of here. That's all we got, that was 175 bucks, so that was not cheap. Let's go home and open it. But before we get into it, I do have a giveaway. I'll be giving away one of these mystery boxes that we just picked up. All you have to do is like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, let me know down below. What is your favorite item we grabbed from Walmart or what is your favorite pull? And make sure to let me know what you think about the cubes. All right, I went ahead and pulled these out because there's just a lot of junk in those ETBs. I mean, it's cool stuff, but nothing we need to see here. There's a code card right there. Let's just go ahead and get into the opening. Mystery Power Cube, you will be coming up in the middle of our blisters. But first, we gotta get to Monstrous Revenge to see if we can pull that Dark Magician that I love to call the Gaia. Okay, Battles of Legend, Monstrous Revenge. It was really cool to actually meet a fan there. Uh, I was just scanning my stuff, like getting ready to leave. I was recording myself and everything. So he looked over and he was like, are you, he's like, are you Ruxin? I was wondering why someone was buying those cubes. Those are terrible. So that was really funny. Because I was like, yeah, I mean, you should not buy these usually. We'll find out. Maybe these are better. Who knows? But normally they're really terrible. Oh, a Nightmare Corruptor Eblay Secret Rare. So it's two from the back. I couldn't remember because we've been opening so many other packs recently. We're going to open a couple of these because I really want that alt art Lugia. I've, I told you guys in the other video, it's my favorite Pokemon. So we're going we're gonna to do a little search for it. Keep it up. This is like the set that I care about because it has the Lugia potential. Um, so hopefully we can get lucky. Raconid, we have a Golbat. We have Stone Journer. Smeargle. Litten, Petlil, Chinchow, Pharisee, a lot of nice Pokemon in here. We have a Radiant Alakazam. That's pretty cool. Alakazam's awesome. And uh, a Talonflame. So we did get something out of there. Let's go back to here. I, I think I needed to buy a couple more to make it an even eight. I think I only bought like six or seven of these. So we might have an extra Pokemon pack or something, but that's okay. We have Battles of Legend, Monsters Revenge. Look, there he is. The, the first two blisters have had the card that we want on the cover art. Can we get it? Come on. We need some luck. If we pull one out of here, that would be insane. We have a Lamia. We have a Anopunk Xeomin. Final Cross. We have Duality Secret Rare. All right, that's a pretty good one, or at least it was when it came out. Who knows what the price is now? I mean, you guys know. You just saw it on the screen. All right, let's keep going. The Mystery Cube is staring at me with that 10K. I mean, the 10K Dragon, it's like, yeah, you're going to pull me out of here. It's definitely going to happen. I mean, I keep saying that, but I just don't believe it. There's no way. Mystery Cube. <laughs> There's no way. They're always so bad. But maybe this is the turnaround with Candice. B, hey, B, I don't know that Pokemon. We have Fungus, Sandy Gast, Relincant. We have the Halucha. Oh, Ruxin Special. We have Rufflet. We have Sandy Gast. Even if you go to different TCGs, they're so Ruxin Specials. And Keldeo. Okay, there is one extra Pokemon pack. So I'm going to open this real quick. And then we'll get back to Monster's Revenge. Probably going to... When are we going to open the Power Cube? I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Maybe at the end. Maybe in the middle. Who knows? Who knows when we'll do it? We have the uh, code card for you guys. I wish Yu-Gi-Oh! would do code cards for Master Duel. How cool would that be? 
if, if you could get a code card for Master Duel, let me know in the comments. I mean, that's a good idea, right? I mean, I mean, it's not like it's my idea. People have said that before, but that is something they should do. They have a regenerative energy and uh, a Dragon Bolt. Dragon Bolt, super rare. I mean, or whatever you call it, hollow card. Super, it's a super rare, let's be honest. I mean, everything should revolve around Yu-Gi-Oh rarities right now. Just kidding. Oh, we just opened that pack. Okay, very interesting. I think people were like, yeah, you open these really weird. And I'm like, yeah, I, I can't help it. I just It just rips right across, you know, you get right into it. I open the pack at the same time. So honestly, that's just more efficient, in my opinion. I mean, I'm just, <laughs> just killing it here. Bestial Ball Drake. Remember when we pulled a really miscut one? That was pretty cool. Puppet Rook. The Performa Pal Classic Rebo. Very awesome. We have the Punk Rising Carp and the Photon Jumper Secret Rare. We're still searching, still searching for the cards we're looking for. There's two separate cards that we need. We've done several videos on both of these cards and have not had any luck. Let's see if we can turn that around right here. We have a Fighting Energy, Fighting, Crocker Rock, Anarith, Meowstic, Beldum, Krogunk. We have Solosis, Zubat, Elgian. We have Furisode Girl, I don't know what that means, and a Incineroar. All right, so we're starting it off and continuing it with badness. Don't worry, we're going to open up some epicness out of Battles of Legend Monsters Revenge. I mean, I uh, heard recently how they're doing the 25th anniversaries. They're, there's still going to be like tons of like 25 in each one. So it's going to be hard to pull whatever we want these days. Like I'm going to have to get a lot of cases, which is pretty rough. Foxy Tune, very expensive, I should say, because obviously it did not work for us last time with the uh, Dark Magician, and the Magical Knight of Dragon or whatever it's called. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what it's called. Let's just call it the, the Dark Magician Gaia is what we should call it. One, two, three, four, come on. We have had nothing out of here so far. Fire energy, this has not been a fire opening. Just saying, Fletchlander, it's been pretty low. Amolga, Metatite, Kevin Durant. We got Ralts, Fletchling, Crowagunk, and we finally got a V, which is, it's the low end V, so it's not that crazy, but hey, it's a V, we'll take it. All right, I think it's time. Let's crack into the mystery power cube. I know, I'm throwing you guys off. I'm not doing it at the end. I'm doing it right now. Can we pull something awesome? So we took the wrapping off, one booster pack, one mystery item, three duelist packs, three bonus foreign packs, whatever that means, five rare cards and 20 common cards. Here's what we're gonna get. We're definitely getting these, right? 100% Starlight Lighting Storm. That's killing us on our investment from 2022, by the way. We have a uh, Magical Hero is pretty cool. Flame of Destruction is pretty cool. Star Pack, no. And then uh, Duelist Pack Kaiba would be pretty cool. I'm trying not to spoil it too hard. Uh, I'm gonna try to open it by going like this. Let's pull out a pack. There's actually a lot of packs in here, more than there used to be. Blazing Vortex, okay, that's a pack. That is a Starlight Rare pack, potentially. Let's see if we can pull one. Can we get that Pot of Prosperity? There we go, we have Synchro. What if there was an emit? That'd be the best Mystery Power Cube of all time. Fabled, Springins, we got the uh, Degamma, we have the Dragon Blitz, and a Super Rare, so no, it will not be in there. Let's do one more Battles of Legend before we go to the next pack in the Mystery Power Cube. Let's see if we can get the card on the cover art. There's five different cover arts, I think. We keep pulling the same one. It's just rubbing it in our face, like, ha, 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 ha. You will never pull this card, Puppet Pawn. We have Black Mamba, R.I.P. Kobe. We have the uh, Danelle. We have a Teller Knight Tolmaeus. Okay. Still a lot of packs to be open in this video. The cube actually has what? One, three, seven packs in it. You usually don't have nearly that many in one mystery item, whatever the mystery item is. I see something a little shiny here. Wait. One, two, three, four. Will it be the shiny that we want? The Lugia. Come on. We have the alternate art, by the way. We have Psychic. Nice. Meowstic. Gem Trainer. Give us something good. We got Clang. Where's Clang Clang? Fletching. Chimeco, we have the Phoebus, we have Fennekin, Spinarak, Fungus, and oh, Regidrago V-Star. Hey, it's something. I mean, we'll take it. Regidrago V-Star. No idea if this is a good card. I don't really know a lot about Regidrago, but I do know it is shiny. It's a V-Star, so it's probably not a bad pull. I'll take it. I'm not mad about that. Let's see if I can grab something next. Let's not ruin it here. I'm probably ruining it. Oh, we have a Star Pack. Oh, wait, this is two of them. Star Pack Vrains and Star Pack. That's a, those are foreign packs. Wait, is this one not foreign? Maybe it is. So the foreign packs are star packs. So star pack, one of the worst packs you can open up in general, even in English, is now in foreign edition. So yeah, this is great. Uh, this, is, this is awesome. Yeah, just what we want. Oh, oh yeah, awesome. Yeah, this is, oh yeah, now you gotta buy these. What a deal. Foreign star pack, woo! Man, wow, this is sick. Mystery power key really killing it right now. Really excited, we've got the Fusion, Pelis, I, I'm not, if I try to say that, I'm gonna say something like completely wrong. We have a Chimera and a Opera La Diva Melodiosa. The Melodious Diva. What language is this, by the way? Spanish? Yeah, I'm, I'm a Spanish 
king. Okay, guys, I know everything about... No, I'm just kidding. I did take Spanish, but unfortunately, I didn't learn anything in, the, in that class. So, I don't know. I don't know anything about Spanish. Uh, we have Lingantrante. Okay, yeah, that was cool. I'm glad that we bought those for the foreign packs. Those are incredible. Uh, okay. Dude, it's rubbing it in. Another Dark Magician cover art. This is insane. The cover art is insane right now. It's literally rubbing it in. Okay, don't spoil it. We got Kobe, RIP. Bento, Protection, Sage of Benevolence, and, uh, ooh, an Amazing Dragon Secret Rare. It's amazing. A couple packs left. We got a V-Star, so now we're probably going to get nothing the rest of the way. Or will we get hot right here and pull something crazy? I don't know. It could happen, maybe. One, two, three, four. Here we go. We have a Metal Venomoth, Wallace, Jinx, Drowsy, Growlithe, Mischievous, Whalmer, Murkrow. We have a Talonflame, and we have a Kling Clang. There he is, the Kling Clang I was looking for earlier. A couple packs left. What can we get out of here? No spoilers, no spoilers. Not looking, not looking. You guys better not be looking. I'm trying not to look, but I kind of have to look. Okay, oh, Synchro Storm. Okay, yeah, not the best set. Uh, we can get the Baron, which has been reprinted. We can get a Ghost Rare, so those are the options. Speed Lift. Necro Fleur, we have... Miriamne, we have high speed roid clear wing rider. That's an ultra. Hey, that is an ultra. We will take it. Supers aren't even guaranteed. So this is actually a pretty nice pull. Couple packs left before we get into the rest of the mystery cube. Here we go. Okay, finally didn't give us the uh, dark magician. Maybe that's a sign that we'll actually pull it here. Maybe it's a sign. Blisters from Walmart always have done so well for me. Just kidding. I don't think I've ever pulled anything good. We have a uh, ghost sleeper and a shadow's light. Also, I think a pretty decent card. Last silver tempest. We at least got a cool card. We did not get the card we were looking for we got a cool card all right here we go cool stuff there one two three four let it be an epic alternate art we have water breaks in sigilif i hate that pokemon we have golbat swablu rotom Baneri, dreepy fampy altaria there we go look at the centering on this thing it's so wide on the right side and so skinny right there interesting and a dragonite very cool pokemon so not a bad last one to end on but also not what we're looking for don't worry we still have the mystery cube i'm gonna i'm gonna pull out more packs it looks like we got a couple legendary duel of the first they're at least first dead that's good Let's get the Magician sold. I like how they put these in these cubes and completely crush the packs. They barely fit in there. All right, Aqua Dolphin. We have Magician's Rod. Good common card. There's all, oh, these are freaking light edition. There's like three of them. Boo. <laughs> they don't even give you a real one. You're not going to get anything. Three. I mean, you don't even get rares guaranteed in this, I don't think. Oh my gosh, these cubes are terrible, which, I mean, what did we expect? We kind of expected that. Is that all the packs? It might be all the packs. Oh, there's our random item. This might be cool. Oh, uh, we have a metal dog tag. Okay, we got to open this. Metal dog tags. Let's see what it is. Will we get the blue eyes or dark magician? Oh, you know I'm going to be wearing this. What is it? Oh, it's not It's not a blue eyes. Yami Yugi. Okay. All right, you know I'm about to be wearing this to the next YCS. It doesn't fit over my head. Head's too big. Make it wear like this? Like a, like a bandana thing or something all right you know we'd be rocking yami yugi all right now we got this on let's do this uh let's see what do we have i thought we got blue eyes for a second when i saw this okay cool little thing i guess okay you can get yami you can get seto kai by joey wheeler millennium puzzle blue eyes white dragon dark magician dark magician girl red eyes black dragon obelisk wing dragon ross Light. dude we could have gotten so many monsters we got freaking yami yugi i mean i guess yugi's cool but is this our, is this our millennium puzzle do I now have the ability to speak with the Pharaoh? That's the question. All right, give us some luck, Yami Yugi. I think we're all down to the to the cards now, which we all know are complete junk. This is like, this is the reason they do these, these cubes is just so they can scam you into buying their bulk. Uh, let's flip this around. So here are rares that are literally just rares, okay? And then it's a bunch of commons. So we need to look for like banger commons potentially. There's Kaminari Attack. Just got like 50 reprints though. Uh, not seeing much in there. So as expected, this mystery power cube is yet again. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's I mean, it's giving you stuff. At least it's giving you some packs, but the packs are terrible. The cards are terrible. You should never buy these. I think they were like 20 bucks or something like that. So I just want to remind you guys, don't buy them, but hopefully you enjoyed the video. Just confirm this was 20 bucks. So yeah, eh, not your not great value for your money. But hey, if you want to have a little fun, maybe go for those. But usually the boxes are a little bit better they at least give you some fun packs that really was pretty terrible stuff if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to subscribe to the channel for more content like this shout out to tome Flow show daxer jt cho puffins of doom ernesto dienda miss cycle america doister supreme sage 21 and under show ian musa junior barding and mimic echo thank you guys for supporting the channel and i'll see you guys in the next one peace